Jet 24. Here's meteorologist Tom Atkins, your weather authority. Stretch out in Girard, Bob Ferrando, Ford World Cam on Main Street there. Pretty shot. You can see the clouds are just a little bit thicker in the West County, so we'll take you from there. Downtown UPMC Park as the Sea Wolves are playing a double header tonight. And uh, the game must go on. So, what we want to show you in a second on the radar is the fact that a couple spots, especially along and west of 79, could get a shower or sprinkle. Otherwise, a mix of sun and clouds this evening. Game time temperatures 69 to 74 with the northeast breeze. And here it is on live pinpoint Doppler. They kind of come around this ridge here and die as they get closer to, uh, you know, the Erie Meadville. Quarter, but you can't rule out a sprinkle or shower, especially to the west. And certainly tomorrow, we're going to have some showers in the area. Near shore marine forecast northeast winds 10 to 15, gusts to 20, waves 2 to 5 feet, water temperature at 64. And our allergy report still moderate on the tree pollens, grass pollens, and mold spores. Weed pollens were low. Thanks, Dr. Gallagher, for that. Our high today, much different at 75, a low of 66, so much closer to the normal high and low. And since midnight, about 35 hundredths of an inch of rain with a sunset right at 9 o'clock. But for your storm totals, good soaking rains last night. Unfortunately, that was accompanied by some wind damage, especially in Warren County. But we're looking pretty good, mainly dry tonight, uh, 15 hours, 15 minutes of daylight, chance of showers tomorrow. But a beautiful start to summer on Thursday. Now look at these temperatures right now between 72 and 80 degrees. Look at them compared to what they were yesterday. Drops of 7 to 19 degrees from those upper 80s and low 90s. A lot of pictures of these shelf clouds. Thanks, James, for that. That's an indication of wind getting ready to come down. This one near Route 8. This one from Heather in Pittsfield. So Warren County, including my buddy in Saybrook, Gary, seeing some trees down on his property. Erie County, not so bad. Low 70s, northeast. Crew at the Bayfront and Girard, 73 French Creek and Wattsburg. Further south, again, temperatures mid 70s, Union City, Cambridge, as well as Meadville, and out to Wesley, es that would be Espyville, uh, 70s. In Warren County, dry weather here. Titusville at 78, Chandler's Valley at 75. So with dew points back down in the 50s and 60s and a light northerly breeze, a much more comfortable weather pattern until further notice. The front did not make it too far south, and that's the problem because although we're mainly dry right now, some of this moisture is trying to surge back tonight, but probably a better chance of some showers, especially to the south and west tomorrow. But the good news is... These clouds break up tomorrow night, Thursday at 6.07. Uh, we've got the start of uh, summer with temperatures uh, dry in the uh, low 70s there. Patchy clouds, a chance of a shower west of 79 tonight, 55 to 60. East of 79, you're looking at 50 to 55 and dry. As you go on into tomorrow, mostly cloudy, some showers around the area, 73 to 77, not the washout we saw last night. And then decreasing clouds, 51 to 58. There's your summer forecast, Thursday, 77, beautiful weather. More rain possible late on Friday and likely on Saturday, hopefully diminishing and moving out on Sunday. And then some nice weather and warmer temperatures as we go into early next week. And then, of course, you can check out the seven day, the radar, and much more on our website, yourerie.com.